How come I'm still? Now, now I can't do that right now. I can, that season is past. <laughs> you understand what I'm trying to say? But, but what, I, what I did was I went from the season of doing it into the season of teaching it. Into the season of teaching others to teach it. That's where I'm at right now. I'm in the season where I don't do it. I'm in the season where I don't teach it. I'm in the season where I teach others to teach it. But if I never graduated from the doing it season, I forfeit the teaching it season. And I definitely forfeit the teaching others to teach it season. And so if I miss the opportunity to teach it and to teach others to teach it, then I lose a generation. Because I'm out of place. Because I'm out of place. I, some of my players are, see, I'm not coaching football no more. But some of my players are coaching football. So I played, then I coached. Now I'm coaching my coaches. I'm coaching some of my players to coach. And they say, hey, coach, I got this problem. And I say, now you're learning to coach. <laughs> <laughs> After I throw a little salt on them and be like, that's what y'all used to do to me. Right. Okay. <laughs> then I teach them how to work through the process so that they can become a coach. But I've got to be engaged. I can't be still talking about how cold I was. Because right. yeah. right. it's no longer about me. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And, then I, and it's not about them. It's about who they're producing. Right. Come on. Amen. And see, if we still get stuck on that last victory, then, then we begin to make that our, mm -hmm. our, our altar. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. And we say, look at, look at how great I was. Yeah. And we've been asleep for 20 years. We've been, we've been worshiping that for 20 years. Yeah. It's, like, it's like we had a beautiful place called the cross. When we were at the cross, we did great things at the cross. Okay. Amen. We had great experience. A lot of people that's here right now and working in the ministry now came from that season. Yeah. But that season has passed. Amen. 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 That, that, there's no shame in the fact that that season has passed. The shame is what are we supposed to be doing in this season? Right. Amen. Right. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. What are we supposed to be doing now that we're not doing now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, that, and that's what that's what we have to get. I can't just say, oh, you remember 10 years ago? Mm -hmm. Right. That's what, yeah, just, yeah. isn't that a trip? 10 years ago. Remember 10 years ago we did this at the cross? See, if that's what we're still talking about, <laughs> amen, we are failing. True. If it's not just a reference point, amen, to build upon to do the next thing, yeah. we're failing. Yeah. Amen. You, can, you yeah. can't hang your hat on what you used to do. And, and that's part of where we're not pressing. Yes. That's no different than the girls winning the game. That is not a championship. Yeah. That's our game. True. That same team come down and whoop them twice as bad as the one that, that they whooped them. So you got to come back and win again. You got to get better the next time. Yes, you got you got to work. You got to shoot better the next time. You got to play better defense than you played the last game. Yeah, yeah. You you got to shoot a better percentage than you did the last game. You got to be in better conditioning than Come you did on. the last. Like you, it's not over. Ooh. I'm still pressing, so I've got to learn to forget the things that's behind me, so I cannot be comfortable with my last accomplishment. All right, that's good. Yeah. I'm still pressing towards a mark for a higher calling. For, for a greater level of success, for a greater level of accomplishment, there's still more that I can do. Yeah. Even though I've studied the Bible, there's still more that I can know. Even though I pray, there's still I can still go in more. Yeah. How can I be comfortable with my current position when there's still greater? And that's what we've got to be careful of. We've got to be careful to make sure that we're still pushing. That we're still pressing. See, I can't be so tired that, or, or so comfortable with where I am that I don't do nothing else. Amen. And some of us have become very much uh, in danger of becoming stiff. Because we ain't moving. Because we 
you're not moving. You're better than what you've been. There's greater coming, even in the next season. Amen. But you've got to be urgent about what this season is right now. What is it that you're supposed to be doing right now? And don't, don't miss days. Don't miss time. Don't miss opportunity. See, there's something that God has called you to do now right. that you're waiting to get stronger for. There's, some, there's something that you're waiting to develop more. There's something you're waiting to know more scripture. But when you know more scripture, you're in a different season. There you go. You're in a different position. See, there's some things you can do as a student you can't do as a teacher. There's, there's some things you can do as a player that you can't do as a coach. I, I must be on sports today for some reason. Amen. <laughs> but, but, you know, when, you are, when you're a teammate, then you, you're a part of the club. But when they promote you and make you a coach, mm -hmm. you're out the club. Out the club. Yeah. Amen. They don't invite you to the player meetings. None, none of that. Amen, because you were coach. You one of them. When you was the co-worker on the job, amen, and you was just a co-worker, that was one thing. But when they made you a manager, oh, yeah. yeah, it's over with. <laughs> amen. But when they get ready to go out, they don't invite you. Right. They don't invite you. Uh, right. Hey, hey, we finna go to lunch. Oh, where are we going? Oh. <laughs> oh, 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 we didn't think you wanted to come. How come I don't want to eat? <laughs> right. Well, we really said we don't want to eat with you. Right. Because <laughs> you're the manager. <laughs> Amen. And when you're the manager or you're the owner, you're in a different club. Yeah. Amen. So you, there's some things you got to do in the season of being a player. I'm, I'm trying to be through with this, but it must be a lot of milk in this. Because even in ministries, that's the reason why a lot of our churches are weak, because we don't have milk. Amen. Amen. A lot of our, nothing wrong with having the churches, but the churches are weak because we don't have a lot of milk. Amen. So our bones are weak. Our structure is weak. You understand what I'm saying? Or am I speaking too fast? Amen. You understand what I'm saying? And so what happens is, it's not saying that you're not called to pastor, but you didn't milk everything out of the member state. So there's a lot of things you're supposed to milk out of when you were serving under Reverend so and so. Yeah. Amen. But you didn't get that because you was too ambitious trying to become a pastor right. before it was to, before time. Right. So he was just rushing to pastor, right. and and you know it's like being 16 and you're rushing out to live on your own. Right. Yes. Amen. Amen. I don't mean you can't live on your own. It's some lessons that you were supposed to get. Amen. That you just rushed yourself out of. You understand what I'm saying? You can be a team mother, but that ain't convenient. Amen. That's right. Amen. That's something. And you're supposed to be in high school now. Right. Amen. Then get out of high school and go to college and get a job. Amen. And then get a husband. Right. And then get then, then the mother. Right. But, but you don't mean you can't do it the other way, right. but you throw, you throw the system off. Yeah. Amen. And you make it harder on yourself than necessary because you haven't gotten everything out of this state. That's why you got 50-year-old mothers that's trying to turn up. That's right. Yes. Yep. That's that's that's. Because they they missed they missed the turn up stage. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They, when it was time to turn up, they was mothering. Yes. Right. Amen. Yes. And it, now now they're 50 and they try to turn up with the kids. Yes. Right. Ma, so they ma. You know they, they got the kids in the basement turning up with them. No, ma is a movie. That's not for you. <laughs> Amen. Amen. But but you see what's happening. Is if we're missing our season. Yeah. And then we get a relapse of that something that's missing in our life, and then we go back and try to fulfill that deficiency. Over with. Yeah. Amen. Over with. I look crazy trying to put on a football uniform. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even want to model a football uniform. You understand what I'm saying? But 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 that seat in that season, do great. Amen. What's, what season are you in now? What should you be doing now? See, what is it that you should be pressing toward? Right now. Doesn't matter how good you were yesterday. It doesn't matter what you accomplished on yesterday. It's what are you supposed to be doing now? Forget the things that you did yesterday. Start over at zero. And what can you do right now? What is it that you need to accomplish in this time, in this season? What is it that you're missing because you've been asleep and comfortable with your last accomplishment? So 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 what you got, what you got. So what you got a job and you make a hundred thousand dollars. Is there something wrong with making 200? Amen. What, 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 
What's wrong with the next promotion? What's wrong with moving to the next position? What's, what's wrong with expanding your territory? What's wrong with it? So, so you got a nice house. What's wrong with getting a bigger house? Amen. Are you working toward it? So you got $10,000 in the bank. <coughs> what's wrong with having $100,000 in the bank? Some of us are just saying, so I got $10 in the bank. Amen. So what's wrong with having $10,000 in the bank? Are you, or, or what are you pressing toward? What are you doing for your children's children? Amen. What are you establishing right now? See, this is the season for you to do it. You, you got to do it in this season. What you, you rich, you rich, CC, but what are you doing for your grandchildren? See, what have you established? What, where is your foundation for your grandchildren? Hmm. See what I'm saying? It's not, not always about talking, going and get the new pair of shoes. But what, but what are you sewing in? What are you building? You can't get complacent and comfortable like I'm chilling. Chill in heaven. Amen. That's right. Chill in heaven. Right now, there's still more to do. There's still more to do, and, there's, and if you're still breathing and watching me, there's still time to do it. There's still, there's still time to get more done. Amen. And maybe not what you could have done before, but you can do something else. What is it today that I need to be doing? Because you're better than where you've been. You're better than what you used to be. Now, let's work on where we are. This one thing I'm doing. I forget the things that's behind me. I'm forgetting all the failures and I'm forgetting all the falls that fall downs and, and all the times that I flop. It doesn't matter. And I forget all the successes and I forget all the victories and I forget all the championships. It doesn't matter. This one thing I gotta do, I gotta press. I've got to press toward the mark because there's a higher calling that God has set for me. Amen. And I've got to do more. I've got to do i got to keep on working on daily. Amen. i got to keep on being better than I was yesterday. i got to get up and put myself back on the altar and say, now what can I do to get this better than it was before? Amen. And then when God gets ready, he'll lay up for me the crown of life. Amen. And then I'll get the reward for the work that I've done. Amen. And one of the old preachers say, uh, let the works that I've done speak for me. I'm praying for you that, that you will not be satisfied with where you've been, but you will have the ambition, amen, and I hope this message inspires you to push past your current position. Doesn't matter how where you are, you may be doing great, but you can be greater. Amen, you may be doing a lot, but you can do more. Amen, and I just don't want you to be satisfied with where you are. Be, be, be better. Amen. Be all you can be. Hashtag the army. Amen. <laughs> let God use you while you have this time. And let him get the glory out of your successes. I thank God for you and we're praying for you that God will continue to bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Come on, give God a hand of praise. Amen.